Think you've seen it all when it comes to farming? Think again. From vertical gardens in the heart of the city to fully automated underwater crop systems, today we're taking you on a journey to explore 11 of the most mind-blowing farms you've probably never heard of. These are not your average fields and barns. These are game changers in agriculture. Let's dive in. Our aim is to cultivate the highest quality crops to benefit people everywhere, say the creators of this innovative vertical farming approach. Since 2004, their goal has been to maximize yield from even the smallest plots of land, and the results are impressive. Imagine this. The setup delivers as many as 26 harvests per year, all while using just 1% of the land needed for traditional farming. The core of the system is a unique aeroponic method they engineered themselves, which delivers moisture directly to the roots via a fine mist. This technique uses 40% less water than hydroponic systems and allows for real-time monitoring and adjustment of growing conditions, ensuring optimal plant development. With just a single button press, you can generate fresh, nutrient-rich feed for livestock. No waste, consistent output year-round, and 95% less water than open field farming. It may sound futuristic, but this system already exists. What you see is a vertical hydroponic solution called HydroGreen, designed to boost efficiency on modern farms, especially critical amid concerns over global meat supply. The system is also eco-conscious, high quality, feed helps reduce methane emissions from cattle. It's scalable too, with models available for herds of 100 to 1,000 cows. The intelligent automation handles seeding, irrigation, and lighting. In the basic setup, two units can yield over 1,300 pounds of feed daily. A full fleet of 12 can replace the output of hundreds of acres of farmland. While we're discussing livestock, let's shift to dairy production. Cow's milk accounts for around 81% of global milk output, and with consumption expected to rise until at least 2030, smarter solutions are in high demand. On display is a cutting-edge automated dairy system that prioritizes both farmer and animal welfare. Cows have the freedom to choose when to rest, eat, hydrate, or be milked. The company behind it touts the iFlow design, which is low noise and offers precise alignment, accommodating even atypical udder shapes. Energy usage is cut by 20%, and the interface is fully smartphone compatible, simplifying daily operations. We're facing an urgent challenge, say the team behind another innovation. Their concern? A looming scarcity of resources. That threatens the affordability of food worldwide. Their solution is a compact, mobile hydroponic farm built for extreme efficiency. Designed to sidestep complex supply chains, this mobile unit enables local food production anywhere it's needed, saving time, space, energy, and water. Each farm is capable of producing 240 pounds of microgreens and around 120,000 seedlings with nearly perfect germination rates. Plus, it operates even in sub-zero conditions down to minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Leafy greens and herbs are essential, but what about high protein foods like fish? Norway is paving the way with an advanced offshore aquaculture facility, and China is actively supporting the effort by connecting international stakeholders across the ocean farming and seafood industries. This floating fish farm is built to raise over 22 million pounds of salmon, housed in a massive 1,236 foot structure taller than the Eiffel Tower if stood upright. The farm includes six dedicated tanks and is engineered to endure waves as high as 33 feet. In stormy weather, the entire structure can rise by 13 feet for added protection. Public reports suggest the total project investment exceeded $197 million. We're still diving into the world of aquaculture. Interestingly, working in water systems for both residential and commercial use can eventually lead to innovations like this. On screen is a 12,500 square foot fish farming facility developed with help from American experts. The team is currently tracking the performance of a tilapia breeding program. These fish were introduced 242 days ago as juveniles and have since grown to around one and a half pounds each. 
The facility includes five independent water recycling units, and the harvested fish are shipped globally. One shipment is even scheduled to arrive in China just in time for Lunar New Year. Initially, the mortality rate was estimated at 10 percent, but it dropped to just 2 percent, which has significantly boosted profitability. Why settle for plain old bridges when you can transform them into living installations? It's more affordable and straightforward than you might think. Take this stunning example from a German city, which becomes a seasonal landmark each spring. Originally constructed in 2000 for an expo, the 49-foot-long floral tunnel bridge weighs over 41,000 pounds. It features 2,160 flower pots filled with fragrant and colorful blooms like lavender, violets, sage, and wool flowers. The concept beautifully blends art, green space, and engineering, creating an immersive experience that starts every April. Now for a smart farming idea that could be deployed practically anywhere. This vertical farming system produces twice the yield of typical setups and features a modular layout that ensures efficiency throughout the year. It's no wonder a major name like Driscoll's, once responsible for nearly a third of all U.S. berries, decided to back the project. Their motto is simple. A farm is only as good as the tools behind it. Today's smartphones are more advanced than the tech used in the Apollo missions, so why not apply similar innovation to farming? The result is a fully automated grow system controlled by its own Plenty OS software, with crops nurtured in a special sponge medium instead of soil. So far, it's performing well with onions, basil, cabbage, and sorrel. So which came first, the egg or the chicken? If you go by the calendar, the egg wins. World Egg Day is observed on the second Friday of October, while World Chicken Day follows on the second Thursday of November. Either way, Tech advancements deserve credit for modern poultry production. What you're looking at is a German-engineered poultry solution, ready to be scaled across Europe. It boasts automated systems, efficient airflow, and components that are easy to clean or replace. Robotic arms can even be added to the production line when needed. And if farmers face challenges, the company offers full technical support to keep operations running smoothly. Here's a bold vision for agriculture's future. A high-tech, fully self-operating farm that could reshape how food is grown. The team behind it believes the age of robotic farming has arrived. Their prototype, a 43,000 square foot smart farm that matches the output of a conventional farm spanning 1.3 million square feet. Robots handle everything, seeding, planting, relocating crops, and the system is designed to function in or near cities. That's crucial, considering nearly 40% of produce spoils before reaching store shelves. Placing farms close to markets helps solve that problem while also cutting down on shipping costs and emissions. Prepare to grow smarter, say the minds behind this next innovation. And they're not exaggerating. Their fully automated system is designed to significantly boost productivity while generating fast returns on investment. Tailored for cultivating leafy greens, this setup handles everything from seeding to harvesting entirely on its own. No manual work required. On top of that, the hydroponic platform slashes water consumption by as much as 95% compared to traditional agriculture. That means customers get greens that were picked less than 24 hours ago, not days or weeks old. The total annual production? An astonishing 2.2 million feet of fresh greens. According to data from the United Nations, even before the global pandemic hit, over 690 million people around the world were struggling with hunger, a number more than 10 times larger than France's population. One of the biggest challenges humanity faces is addressing this food insecurity. That's where innovations like this mobile farm come into play. Housed inside a 40-foot-long shipping container, the farm is split into three distinct sections. An operator station, a controlled environment for crops, and a utility area filled with tech gear. What can it do? Quite a lot. The farm can produce roughly 4,400 pounds of cucumbers per year, and it's capable of growing over 300 varieties of crops, including medicinal plants. Each container is built to operate. For 10 years, and thanks to the plant keeper system, farmers can manage everything remotely, 
even from their smartphones. Now, why should we care about algae? You might think of them as ingredients in food or skincare products, but their most critical function might be environmental. Algae play a key role in purifying water. That's the driving force behind the Algae Demo Initiative, which aims to restore marine ecosystems. The team believes algae cultivation can improve ocean water quality, reduce acidification, and even boost fish populations. This project involves growing algae across a sea surface area, ranging from 107,000 to 215,000 square feet in the North Sea. Monitoring is done using underwater drones and intelligent software enhanced with EAT. Artificial intelligence. It's all part of a larger movement to grow the blue economy. A strategy that leverages marine resources to fuel economic development while improving global well-being.